just as I'm about to stream, I get the notification that Rashid's gameplay trailer drops. Oh my gosh, I was not expecting that. So let's just check. Let's check my boy Rashid the Turbulent win now. Let's see how he's doing. Let's see his gameplay. Oh. Wait, they kept his voice actor? Sick. He looks so good in this. They really gave him a good outfit change. Oh my gosh, the, the style. <laughs> Oh, okay, throw looks good. Oh, oh! That was in the air. Oh! The air slide. Oh! Damn, yeah, there it is! Spinning mixer. Yep. I'm liking it. Okay. Alright. Yes. Oh. That's a sick super. Oh my gosh. Yes, they kept that moving! All right, let's see his. Let's see this, and oh, <laughs> yo! He, he looks, he looks a lot of fun. Oh, all right, let's see this level three super. Oh, <gasps> he's jumping through the tornado. There's no way. I, they did. They really got your good side, man. They really got your good side. Oh my gosh. And... Oh, there's his original... Wow, it really doesn't even look like they've changed much. Okay, so wait, was that it? Oh, okay, wait, 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 hold on. Hold on a sec, wait, where's the... When's he dropped, though? So... I definitely think so. I'm guessing more more than likely if we're going to play with him in World Tour, you're probably going to have old Nichelle unlocked in the game. Because they did say that the DLC characters will be available to, like, train with in the World Tour mode. So we will be able to, like, interact with them, which is going to be sick um, as it goes on. Because like, I'm curious to, like, see text messages between Rashid and Akuma. So that will be fun to see. But yeah, I like him. Like in all the kick moves. I remember this unique attack when I was first learning him. I remember, yep. I love that an animation for him. The push-ups victory animation. The kick loops. So I guess this this was an air grab, right? This is... was. Let me see. So this is, was a whole air grab. Or right, let me see here. How does it go? Oh! Oh my gosh! That's... Slide two. Oh, well, hold up. Let me see. I just noticed this. So look, wait. I th okay, wait. Let me see again. I thought he went over the sandblast for a second. Is what it looked like. I thought he was like going over the sandblast in a way. That's what it looked like to me. But I do like the supers. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> He's a streamer. <laughs> Bro's a streamer. All right. We're, we're dropping some gift subs on him. He's getting a bunch of gift subs after this. Let me see that again. Hold up. I, I love that move. I love how you can just like... It was like for his like unique attack where you would like use the medium buttons. And you, he would like bounce himself um, up in the air over you. And yeah, yeah, there we go. He would do a hop attack on you. It was sick. I love it. And yep, I guess that's the level two. The air combos. <laughs> yep, here we go. And the bouncing of the tornado, it's so sick. Yep, he's definitely gonna look fun. I'll tell you that right now, he's going to be a lot of fun in a few weeks so if you are worried though that you would have to deal with him at evo not to worry because he is july 24th so that means he will be soft he will be soft banned for evo at the very least because i 
Yeah, because um, the wait time for, like, the DLC characters is always a month, so that way they're not, like, broken at, like, the start of it. Because, like, that happened with, uh, that happened with, I'm trying to think, who were some DLC characters that I saw drop at the time? Because, like, I know Hero dropped from when Smash was still at the, there, um, who else was available? Uh, I just know there was, like, a lot of characters, but overall... Definitely gonna look looks fun, and we'll definitely try him out when he launches in a few weeks. So, hope you guys enjoy my reaction to it. He's look, he definitely looks like a lot of fun. Looks better than how he was in five, and hope to see more of him um, in the future.